Welcome back to the SPS Tech Department's YouTube channel. If you are new here, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to receive notifications when new content is added. Today's video will show you how to pull analytics and course uh, access reports for students. From the home page of your course, you'll click New Analytics. Now, New Analytics is an interactive tool that helps you and your students better track performance and activity within the course. You'll be able to learn which students have viewed pages and resources and participated in assignments and which students may need a little more encouragement. So this first screen, when you get into it, will show you the average course grade um, for this particular course. And then you have four tabs here in which to choose from. The first one is course grade. Um, so you can see here, uh, these, this is the course grade for you know, each of the assignments. But if you wanna see what a particular student is doing, you would click the drop down menu here, choose your student, and then you'll see um, a comparison in your student's grade to the average course grade. The next report is the weekly online activity report. Notice how it keeps the same student here, but if you want to switch and see another student, you can do so just by clicking the drop down menu. But what this report shows, it gives you the dates um, that you're looking at here. And this graph shows you the student's weekly online activity in the course compared to the average online activity spent in the course by all students. So you can, you can um, see the comparison there. The next tab is a student report. Again, it's holding on to the last student that I looked at. And what you'll see here it shows um, what your student's grade is in this course, um, his last participation date, the last time they viewed the page, the number of page views for this particular course, and the number of participations. The next tab is the reports menu. And this gives you a list of reports that you can run um, for your students. Clicking the information bubble will tell you what type of report it is, what type of information that you, that you will get. Okay. But when you're ready, just click run report. And then you can filter on a particular date or a particular student and then click run report. And this will download in your files as a CSV file. So that was all um, new analytics from the home page in Canvas, and that's right here. So the next group of reports can be found by clicking the People tab in the navigation bar. And what you'll do is you'll locate your student from the list here. And this screen gives you a lot of good information as well. Um, on this screen, you can see for each of your students, uh, the last date and time of activity and the total amount of time that the students have spent in your course. Okay. After that, you'll, you can click on the student's name and this sidebar will open up. And this sidebar gives you some information as well. You can view the student's grade, um, how many assignments are missing, late, um, the grade on each assignment and the activity for this particular student compared to the rest of the class. Okay, you can also click grades here to see the grade book, and then you can also get to new analytics from this icon here. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna click the link here um, to open up even more information for this particular student. And once you've clicked on the student's name, it will take you to the student's access or usage report. Um, from here, you'll click access report. This is going to give you a lot of good information. It's going to show you how many times the student has viewed the content in your course and the date the content was last viewed. So this screen right here can give you a lot of good information. Um, if you have students who haven't been doing a lot of work, um, you can, you know, open this access report to see actually how many times the student has viewed or participated um, in your course. I hope this information has been 
useful and helpful for you. This concludes our video on how to pull new analytics and student access reports. Um, again, please remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell for notifications when new content is added.